McDavid. Moves in, McDavid goes upstairs! What a goal! Hey guys, how's it going? It's Etanius here. Welcome to episode number 8 of this NHL 21 player creation series here on my channel. If you guys are new to this series, make sure you go up into the top corner of the video right now. Click the link, it will send you to the entire playlist so you can catch up on all the players I have so far created and you can add them to your game. Also, I do appreciate all the comments you guys leave on these videos. It really helps me kind of keep up to date with uh, all the you know, updates with the rosters and what you guys are seeing in the game, players you want to see added and so on. It really does help and it is truly making a difference with this series. I know I haven't uploaded this series in a while, but let's get through some comments here quickly. The first one is that I did go and do a bunch of player correcting as far as I had the guys on the wrong teams. Um, so these players would consist of, if I can find them, uh, Devin Levy or Devin Levi, however you want to say his name. I had him on the wrong team. I also had, I believe it was, where is he? Yeah, Spencer Knight. I had those two guys on the wrong team. So now those Florida Panther prospects are on the right team. Um, everything else so far, I think was looking good in here besides a couple guys that were actually added into the game. I deleted and went and updated. So that means we're going to have to go over to the rosters area here and click on edit players so the guys that you were saying were already in the game consisted of i believe it was just simon edvinson for the last video edvinson plays on the Forlunda indians and i've got him up to a 71 overall medium elite now um so we can go in just quickly take a look at him as a player just edit him quickly show you guys that you know i have done some work on him and uh made sure that he is actually up to date there so i did upgrade his stats ever so slightly you could see them there I'll, I'll click on him again just so you guys can pause the video if you want but just slightly change some of the equipment that was pretty much the main thing in there and his potential weight everything else is the same um so yeah there you can see my slightly updated um statistics there for him and then there are two other players in this video that we are going to get to so the first one here being i guess they're both on the same team actually yeah they are okay funny enough so the first player who's actually a goalie that we are going to or that i have edited is jesper wallstead you guys can see him here uh, I have upgraded him from a medium starter to a medium franchise goalie. Also upgraded his 64, 65 overall rating to a 69 at 17 years old because I truly believe that Jesper Wallstead is that good and that he is going to be, you know, kind of like the next big goalie in hockey, along with Yaroslav Askarov and a couple other guys that have been drafted in the first round. But uh, 70, or I guess 69 overall rated Jesper Wallstead there at 17 years old. You guys can pause the video if you want to take a look at the statistics. I did edit a couple other things here, just, you know, apart from his potential. Uh, I went into the equipment, made sure he had all the Luella gear on just for now. Um, obviously, when he gets drafted, uh, you'll change that to whatever team he actually gets drafted to, but that is Jesper Wallstead. Slightly updated, but you know, his hair should be longer, but it is what it is. And um, yeah, there are the attributes again for you guys. Again, if you want to pause, feel free to do so. But that's just a quick kind of spam through there. So that would be the first actual player we were going to do this episode before he got added to the game. So yeah, just for well studying the game. Now, I wasn't going to create him if he didn't get added, but he did. So the other player we had in here was Fabian Lysel. Again, 69 overall, 17 years old. I guess this would be 2021 eligible player still. So I have gone and edited him as well. You can probably see his uh, his name on the screen here or his picture on the screen here right away. See how well a job EA has done with him. But I definitely updated his statistics um, as well as a couple other things. So he is, all these stats are good. I'm not actually going to touch that. I don't think I touched that. Uh, just the equipment. I changed his skating or like his socks around a bit, his sock tuck, uh, his tape job. And I think that was it. They were pretty accurate on everything else, but 
I bumped him up from a medium six to a medium elite because uh, I think he's going to be a really good player again in this upcoming draft. So there you can see just some upgraded stats on him. I improved his shot a bit to get him up to that 69 overall. I believe, again, he was like a 63 or 65, something along those lines. So two players that I had listed down for this upcoming episode were already in the game. So that was, again, Jesper Wallstead and Fabian Lysel. Again, feel free to pause if you guys want. Now I'm going to get into the final three players I have created for episode number eight here. Um, these guys aren't in the game. I don't know if they'll ever actually be added to the game until they get drafted, that kind of thing. But let's go take a quick look at these three remaining players that consist of Ido Aguchi, Chaz Lucius, and Iro Niemi. So cue the time lapse coming up here and I will see you guys at the end of the video. All right, guys, so there you have it. I hope you enjoyed episode number eight here. Uh, these players today, you know, a little bit different than how we normally do things, but that's okay. I'm glad I was able to kind of get through all these roster updates and everything and new players added. If you guys are wondering why Aguchi is on um, uh, Bay Como, is because I was just looking for a random North American team to put him on, and I don't know, I just pick them kind of out of random so that's where i've put a gucci for now he's obviously i believe in the ushl right now so not exactly accurate on that one all the rest of these are um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you uh actually go back pause the video add these players to your game and uh, if you did enjoy make sure that you go down below 
consider dropping a like on the video. It really helps the YouTube algorithm drive more views to this ch uh, video and my channel in general. Also, feel free to subscribe if you haven't yet. We're trying to hit 1,200 subscribers, and I know you guys can do that. And also, feel free to leave comments for players you would like to see in upcoming videos. I am taking all those players into account, adding them to my spreadsheets, and making sure I get to them eventually. But anyways, guys, that's going to be it for me. This is Etanios signing out, and see ya.